So it just, as far as the first thing I would say was uh, seeing was one, see what your environment is around you. Uh, so that way you can figure out, okay, what are some practices I can probably implement at home that will uh, be helpful for my family as well as myself. Um, and hopefully it will align with uh, your passion that you want to do as far as with playing um, on the field and everything as well. So it will be hydration practices. Uh, the easiest thing that I like to implement is, is if you just follow just having a cup of water every hour if possible, um, setting an alarm or something like that, if you will, uh, especially as we get into these hot summer months. Uh, down, I feel like I was just recently in Louisiana, so I feel like it was summer every all the season long, mm -hmm. every day. <laughs> but um, yeah, just hi just hydrating as far as those practices, making sure that you're not skipping breakfast in a sense too, uh, depending on what time as far as you wake up. Uh, making sure that you start as far as with everything and, and get an adequate amount of protein and uh, rather it be some uh, eggs some Greek yogurt, uh, rather depending on what practices that you follow. Uh, and then also just ensuring that you have a nice balanced plate as well with some solid carbohydrates starting your day off with some vegetables or fruit, uh, meaning if you need to even saute your vegetables with your eggs as well, that's absolutely fine. Um, and pertinent and helpful. So um, one thing I would say is just, again, hydration, um, ensuring that the environment and also your family can actually practice these safe and also great, helpful, uh, nutritious, nutritious practices with you. Um, and then also starting your day off by not skipping breakfast and then seeing again what is sleep. Um, sleep as well during this time is very difficult. Uh, right now, I know that uh, with uh, socialization and all these challenges that we have here and how we're trying to take care of ourselves mentally and also take care of our families as well. Um, that's another thing that we're trying to figure out uh, day to day. And um, one of the biggest things that we can also do in this time is, is not only take care of ourselves by being, you know, a whole and just mentally taking care of ourselves and our family and spending time with our family as well, but also as far as like accumulating, making sure that you're getting uh, good sleep, getting a good stepping away from the computer screens, the, uh, the cell phone screens, um, anything. Because I know if you are having jobs still, Zoom fatigue is a real thing. Yes, um, it is. Step away, right. Stepping away from those things uh, as, at least an hour, an hour and a half before bedtime, uh, trying to stay in, in that same routine with bed. So that way you can get up and start your day off and have um, some, some great brain functioning um, habits and, and get a good, nice breakfast in as well. Uh, to start off their day and then we can go into basically the steps on how you will fuel throughout the day here soon. So, so.